Hey guys, Sam Sabri from Windows Phone Central. Today we're going to check out an app from the Windows Store called Reddit with an exclamation mark. Surprise, it is an app for Reddit. It's also free and that's one big thing we like about it. So let's go check it out. Here it is on our start screen. Large live tile, very nice. We will rate it later. So you can log in with your Reddit account, and I've already done that, so you can see my name up there. You can see all the subreddits I've subscribed to on this front page view. You can uh, navigate between your subs, popular subs, recent subs, and search. Uh, it looks like you can also clear all, so if you visit some naughty subs, I guess people don't have to see what you were checking out if you let a friend borrow your Surface or something. So we'll check out how uh, the app looks when you go into a subreddit. So let's go into Windows Phone. So right here, this is the a little hard to see because of all the white space, but uh, you have three things to look for here. The main content right will show up right here, whether it's a text, an image, a GIF, uh, a video, and so on. Um, you can swipe between stories. So that's what's happening here in the middle. And then there's two things going on in the bottom left corner and the top right corner. So right here in the bottom left corner is how you get to the comments. You'll see this little overlay for the top comment. You can tap it and it'll fly in from the right side all the other comments. And then you can scroll through them, sort, uh, you know, best 50, best thousand, new 50, new thousand, random, refresh. It's pretty cool. Uh, you can tap a comment, upvote, downvote. Oh, we'll give them an upvote, why not? And it's really nice. I like it a lot. Uh, let's go to the Xbox subreddit because you can see here this top post is a video. It's hard to tell, but you can just tap the video. There we go. And then from the right, it'll open up uh, YouTube from a, like a web browser control. And then you can watch the video right here. You get the idea. Tap back on the app to go back to Reddit with an exclamation mark. Read the comments on that video that you just watched. And it's pretty cool. And then up here in the top right, you'll see it says more. So if you don't want to navigate through the subreddits like this, you can just tap um, the more in the top right section. And you can quickly scroll through all the posts. I think my internet is a little slow at the moment, but uh, the images for those posts would load in right here too. So you can just kind of scroll through the posts, tap them, and go into them. Um, if you come to an image, you can just tap the, anywhere on the image to get a full screen view of that image. And we'll go back to, uh, and it supports GIFs too. So we'll go to our GIFs, check out how that works. Here we go. So here's this post with a Philippine Tarsier. Click on the comments. Again, just read the comments. It's just a really nice app. Oh, bugs. <laughs> Katy Perry. Performance is pretty good. I'm using this on the Surface Pro, the first gen. Uh, I tried it on my Lumia 2520 and Surface 2, and, and the app works just as well on all of them. Yeah, you can tap up here on the right. Scroll through all the different posts in the subreddit. <laughs> you get the idea. It's a really nice app. Uh, here, when you go to a subreddit that's focused on uh, pictures like Earth Porn, it's really nice just to kind of scroll through, see the image if you want, read the comments, or just tap on the image, get a full view of it. Again, this is a free app, and that's one thing that we like about it. There's no ads anywhere in the app. Um, it's a pretty basic Reddit app, but it does most of the functions you want, and it does not really well. So thanks for watching. If you have any questions, ask them in the comments on either the post or the YouTube video, and we'll catch you later. Take care, guys. Bye.